Africa, hello Jamaati people. My name is Mizuba Kapangu. You guys already know what it is. And I am your Jamaati Entourage New York member. And I bring you guys exclusive interviews with African celebrities making headlines across the world. And I have a special guest here today, Mr. Van Vicker, one of um, Africa's sexiest men alive. According to our Jamaati people, that's what they think. <laughs> so, I think I've seen that. so welcome to Jamaati TV. It's a pleasure having you, especially Thank because you. you did a you know you did a project with us previously. Yeah. Yeah. That so was last year. Yes, yeah, that was last year. So I just wanted to ask you three um, very brief questions. Okay. The first one being, where do you see um, the future of the Nollywood industry? Well, I it's all positive. It's uh, I see it going places. I mean, we've come a long way. The train has been moving. I just happen to hop in at a point, you know, and I'm still I'm, I'm, I'm doing whatever I can to keep the train moving. And I'm sure that train is going to go doo -doo for the next 2,000 years. But as it's moving, we can only hope for the best, right? Better movies, good stories, good pictures, better sound. Uh, by the end of the day, we will, of course, love the association with Hollywood. Because I know it took a long time for Hollywood to recognize Bollywood, mm -hmm. you know, the slum dog uh, millionaire thing. And we're looking for an opportunity where Hollywood will say, Oh, these guys have been moving for a while now. Mm -hmm. Let's see what we can do with them. Mm -hmm. You know, or maybe not the whole uh, Nollywood per se in terms of the movie industry, but maybe make a few, you know, um, actors, actresses in there. But at the end of the day, I think it's still Hollywood. Mm -hmm. You know, so as, uh, like I said, I think the whole thing is forward ever, backwards never. Definitely, that's some great, that's some great advice. So tell me, um, what are some of your future projects that you're working on? Well, I think uh, the latest, and I'm very excited about that, it's it's a calendar mm -hmm. that I'm coming up with. I should be doing a photo shoot here in the U.S. Um, in October. Mm -hmm. Now, the, the good thing about it, I'm going to throw the invitation out there. Mm -hmm via my site, whichever, whichever um, uh, medium we have. I'm going to throw it out to anybody who wants to be on the calendar uh, with me for 2010. Mm -hmm. So th that's the, I think, intriguing thing about it, and very interesting to have whoever is interested to be on the calendar. Now, apart from that project, I, I know we'll be doing the release parties in December, mm -hmm. but uh, another interesting project I'm doing, it's a movie we're about to shoot in um, January, we will be the three different places, locations. We shoot in Haiti, shoot in Jamaica, and the Bahamas. And then we're going to use three major stars mm -hmm. from those three places. So we're going to have a Jamaican in there, going to be from the Bahamas and Haiti, plus Van and Naya. Mm -hmm. So we're trying to bring the Beyonce thing yes, kind of. Of course, it's going to be a completely different story. Mm -hmm. But you know, the last time I shot with Naya was in Beyonce. That was the very last time. And that's possibly years ago maybe yeah yeah so it's exciting you know to have me alongside with Nadia again and then most importantly having these three major stars in the movie of course they make a huge um, um, percentage of, of, of the fan base so I think for me it's so exciting that's my next project and I just can't wait for Jen and I don't and our, we can't wait too because your fans you know, they always want to hear from you, they always want to see you, so I'm sure they're going to be very excited to see that. Cool. Okay, so my last question is going to be a quick and easy one, I know you're very busy, so um, out of all the movies that you've done so far, which one would you say would be your favorite and why? My favorite? Honestly, I don't think I've found my favorite yet. I mean, it, it might be obvious to say Friday Night mm -hmm. or Ross because I produced it, mm -hmm. but I'm, I'm, I'm trying not to be biased here. I haven't found my favorite yet. Yes. I've enjoyed doing the movies I have been doing. They've been excellent. But I don't think I can pinpoint which one is my favorite so far. But I know Beyonce has been the most popular. Definitely. Yeah. Definitely. Well, thank you very much, Linda, for joining us on Jamati thank TV. You. It's been a pleasure. And um, my name is Mazuba Kapam. We do know what it is. It's with Mr. Van Vicker here himself, live in the flesh. You guys can see. We're not lying because <laughs> he's right here. <laughs> so um, thank you very much. We'd like to shout out Nollywood NYC for. Um, Find the video and you know um, doing everything for us and um, we're here at the tropical paradise ballroom in Brooklyn you shouldn't forget that and um, I thank everybody who's been involved in this um, um, event and um, Mazuba Kapangui Jamati on New York 
Um, check out um, this interview when it comes out on Jumanti TV. You guys know the website, www.youtube.com slash Jumanti Online TV. Check out articles that we've done on Jumanti.com. And Ben Griffin himself did a promo with Jumanti um, not that long ago. So yeah. you guys can, if you want to see it, you can go back to Jumanti TV and check in the files. You can search Ben Bicker and um, you guys are going to see it. So thank you very much. Signing off. Peace out. Peace out. <laughs>